find another uh, member of the um, mint family. This is also growing in sort of an open meadow type area um, and fairly moist soil condition. <clears throat> the interesting thing about this is that um, it's a member of the, uh, the genus Salvia and this particular group has interesting uh, structure with the stamens. You see the stamens are shaped like little uh, levers. The anther sacs are separated from each other on little stalks and in fact one of the anther sacs is, is not even functioning. It forms a little knob and this allows the insect to come in, push on that knob and it acts as a lever to force the pollen sac, the other pollen sac, down on the back of the insect um, to affect pollination. Um, so here we have, as a typical mint, we have a big lower lobe, two side lobes, and then at the top, which I've sort of peeled back, is the, uh, the top lip, and it's made up of two fused petals uh, that sort of cap over the, the style and stigma. Okay, this particular species is distinct because of the color uh, the uh, long stalk of the inflorescence that comes up directly from the ground and these large um, leaves that form a rosette on the ground and they often have a what's called a lyre shape to the like the shape of a lyre and so it's called the lyre leaf sage.